This booking photo, provided by Fulton County Sheriff Office, still shows Sean after surrendering and reserved at Atlanta on Friday, August 25, 2023. Then he is accused 17 others accused of destroying will Republican president in White House. Atlanta A. Georgia state senator will not be dismissed after being 118 people accused of former President Donald Trump on charges he tried to illegally overthrow results 2020 presidential elections in state. Government Brian Kemp spokesman Garrison Douglas said on Friday. A three-person panel of state senator he said Sean still did not recommend the abolition of case while waiting for a lawsuit. Nevertheless, a Republican living in the North Atlanta suburb of Johns Creek, a swimming pool contractor and former state Republican Party finance president, he was one. He was still the secretary this meeting and is only one of the three members this group. He is faced with seven numbers including the number of crimes trying to present a public official the mimly of a public official. Eulent. False documents and wrong declarations writings. As required by state law, Kemp appointed Chief Public Prosecutor Chris Carr, as well as Majority Leader of Republican State Senate, Steve Gooch and Majority Leader of Republican State Assembly Chuck F. Strachan. He held a closed hearing on Monday. If state constitution requires recommendation commission governor to suspend an official, the indictment determines that ministration of indictment ministration accused public officials. Office public rights interests were adversely affected. In December 2020, when Republican voters came together, he was still not in public office. He was elected in 1022 and served his first period. The other two Trump voters who were guilty were the former state Republican Party President David Schaefer and Kathy Latham, a woman of a coffee district, was accused of helping people to access voting equipment illegally. A judge tries to move. Last week, the former Trump Chief of General Staff Mark Meadows rejected a similar argument. Two liberal voting groups made a statement that hit the suspension panel to leave still in place. Fair Fight Action political director Nicole Robinson said, The Investigation Commission is incredibly discouraged for Review Commission to do their part in order to protect the sanctity of our elections by holding conspiracy-oriented election denials. Responsible. 